Good morning, Bo. Good morning. Well, Sunday morning coming down, 25th of February, 2024. It's 8, 11 a.m. and 47 degrees Fahrenheit. Supra. Well, the gentleman there who lives with Supra is headed back to his car to do something. And he's going to come back out here. What he's doing this morning is mapping all of Supra's dig locations for whatever reason. The dude spends a lot of time with his dog, I suspicion. I guess I can't really fault him for that. All right, the wind here is kicking up a little bit. We'll check back in later. <laughs> I was trying to get her to jump on the rock. Well, now we're in the woods section of the walk here. There's a new encampment. I don't know if you can see that tent. It's a yellow tent. And just some more Californians moving out to eastern Washington. Where they can do their drugs and stuff. Alternatively, it could be trekkers. This would be a strange place to trek. Unless they have dogs with them, then it'd be a good place to trek. So, we're not going to speculate anymore on that. Keep moving here. Yeah, that's some new trash, Bo. It's okay, come on. Well, now we're headed back. It's been kind of a, an eventless walk this morning, but uh, but a very, very solid poop. Happy about that. We'll just go ahead and repeat our steps here. Retrace our steps, I guess, is what I meant to say. There's some more new traps right there.
have to look and see what we're dealing with. Potential California latrine right there. Uh, yeah, actually, this is bad. Come on, let's get out of here. That's the one thing that we don't want to encounter is the California latrines. I had to wake her up just to put her down for this quick nap. <laughs> Go. <laughs> what you got? Huh? Well, that's all sliced up and ready to go. Uh, been very patient though. Enjoy. Delicious steak and kibble. Good stretch, Bo. You wanna come up? Well, come on now. Grab a toy, shake it off. I got your blanket all down for you there. Seriously? Come on now. Well, let's see what we did here, Bo. Hey, Bo. I want to see his neck. <clears throat> ah, seriously. That is not good. Look what you did. Poor lamb.
Yeah, the lamb is not long for this world. Good morning, Bo. Good morning. You can see how windy it was yesterday. That's bad news. Having a portable toilet on its side like that. Anyway, it is Monday morning. February 26th, 2024. 6.35 a.m. and 37 degrees. Fahrenheit. Up there's Bo, and she and I are fixing to do a morning walk slash extended bathroom trip for the dog. that same dead fish every dog in town who comes out here probably has to pee on that one now it's kind of sad really disrespectful I guess to fish well I guess it's okay to pee on fish because they don't have feelings uh, the poops in the bag Never seen quite a poop like that from Bo. It was like a Pez dispenser situation. But uh, good volume, good consistency. Uh, came out good just in like uh, little sections, making it a little suboptimal to pick up, but easy enough. Okay, I think we're done talking today about dog bodily functions. Let's get this walk going. out here yet.
Uh, I'm just checking to see if Rudy's out here yet. He's not. Uh, hey, Bo. What the hell are you doing? Bo, come on now. Bo, get out of there. Come on. Bo. Bo. Bo, come on. Come on. Probably a rabbit warren. Well, anyways. Moving on, Bo. Uh, something is amiss this morning, the way Bo is acting. My guess is these are all the places Rudy went yesterday. And Bo's picked up the scent. There you go. Good water, Bo. Seriously. Uh, I didn't want to come this far. We've got to do it out and back because of, because of a second dog poop situation. We're going to walk down here and see if we can see Rudy come in the reverse. See, there he is. Good morning. <laughs> yeah, both smelling something, kind of ruining the shot. Hey, Rudy, how's it going? Good morning. I think we're laying in some kind of deer bed right there. We'll pick a better place next time when we need to lie and wait.
Well, now we're gonna head back. Rudy is awful rambunctious in the morning. Supra situation. Good morning, Supra. Good morning. What you doing in Bubba's? Okay, so we gotta go, okay? Alright, let's go, come on. This might be good enough to get her up on the couch. Just a minute, Bo. Waiting on this runner and a little dog that reminds me of Travis and his old dog, Murphy. Well, somebody's excited to be out here this morning and that somebody's Bo there. It is the 27th of February, uh, 6.40 a.m. and 30 degrees Fahrenheit. It's a nice brisk morning, which is optimal for poop walking a golden retriever.
Yeah, we got a poop coming. Well, we made it to Squirrel Alley, not without minor incident. Uh, those two uh, Zimbabwean ridge, Ridgebacks were out on there walking. Is all I could do to hold Bo back because she wanted to say hello. She's never actually met them. And... It's her morning grass bath, I guess. We actually timed this perfect. The sun's just coming up now, which means the squirrels will be coming out of their trees for Bo. Now, we're not intentionally harassing the wildlife. What we're doing is exercising the squirrels who enjoy running around. We're also exercising that dog. Well, now we're in the heart of Squirrel Alley. I'm wondering if we're gonna see any squirrels this morning. Bo. It looks like the crazy squirrel lady's not out here this morning. So we might be able to check out that area of known Squirrel feedings. Yep, there's one already. It was like bear baiting. But people want to feed wild animals in public parks. This is a consequence. You know, the consequence seems to be in action. Yeah, they all went back up in the trees, Bo. Good morning, Mr. Squirrel. What's he doing? Could be another poop on the way here. Yep. Well, the walk has been kind of a bust so far. We do this once in a while because uh, it's actually a longer distance than the Columbia Point walk. 
It also gives Rudy a little bit of breathing room in terms of uh, Bo and her violent ways. That's pretty good, Bo. It's pretty good. Come on. Uh, anyways, that's a dog or something. That ain't no squirrel. Huh. I wonder if it's those guys with that dog. Huh, interesting. Well, it is quite early. Uh, but I think Bo wants to go to sleep. Yeah. That's a very good stretch, Bo. Good morning. Good morning, Bo.
good stretch, bro. Very good stretch. Well, it's Wednesday morning, the 28th of February, 2024. I guess it's a quarter to 7 a.m. and 43 degrees Fahrenheit. We're out here with Bo this morning. Just peed on that dead fish again. Uh, we're out here with Bo this morning doing a morning poop walk. <laughs> Another poop. False alarm, but she is okay. Well, kind of holding back, waiting to see if Rudy comes out from under the bridge, but uh, he hasn't yet. We'll probably meet up him later. Well, the dog has woke up. Golden Ghost! Where did he come from? <laughs> hey, Rudy! <laughs> How's it going? Holy cow. We were fixing to go across that field there and lie in wait. But that Rudy just come up. I didn't see him. Bo, you're worthless.
Uh, Rudy run off almost all the way down the river. I think you might have seen a deer the way he was moving. We got him back. Uh, Rudy run off almost all the way down the river. I think you might have seen a deer the way he was moving. We got him back. We lost Bo. There she is. What the hell's this? Yeah, you took it all the way down the hill. Huh? Yeah. Good boy. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Huh? Yeah. Good boy. Okay, we got to leave it here. Well, it's quitting time now. She's out here picking up some residual balls. Bo will return or retrieve about one tenth of what is thrown to her, which is pretty good for Bo. Hey, Bo. There's nobody. It's, it's just us. Sorry. <laughs> okay. Well, come on. Grab a toy. Come on. It's almost 9 o'clock p.m. I had to go to a work function. Come on up. Thank you. Double dog. Well, it's Thursday morning, the 29th of February, 2024, uh, 6.35 a.m., 53 degrees Fahrenheit. Seriously? Yeah, no. Section of school. Bypass the Go on, drink some water, Bo. 
rare appearance by the man in the orange hat who does remember both from her childhood, her puppyhood. Uh, we're down here at the river now, probably to snack on some goose poop. The beatings will be off camera. Nice job, Bo. She's looking at a leaf. Seriously? Yeah, I don't want to leave her hanging out there. Nice job, Bobo. Come on now. This is a Japanese uh, black boar, gray boar. So we want to try to keep it as a souvenir the best we can. It'll be lost within months, I'm sure. First squirrel encounter. She's so stealthy, she walked around that snake. missed it. <laughs> it's not giving up on that one squirrel. Interesting. crazy lady's not out yet a lot of squirrels this is where she feeds them those couple trees
That's a lot of squirrels. Look left, Bo. Shoot. Uh, they must have seen her. Oh, there's a couple. Okay. Probably, oh yeah, second poop. It's coming out right now. Well, we're kind of backtracking. That poop was right in a kind of a trash can desert. We're gonna use this one right here by the controversial elephant slide. This is also a good known area of squirrels, this little copse of trees. I'm not seeing any right now though. Yeah, Californian just popped up right there in our walking route. So we're gonna uh, split the difference here down the middle, turn around and go back home. Better make a move, Bo. Yeah. Too slow, Bo. Come on. There's a plump one dead ahead, 12 o'clock, on open ground. You ain't gonna get these, bro. Come on. They're too wily. Uh, Bo knows something's up. I gotta go to another work function now, so I gotta abandon her for about, I don't know, an hour and a half. But, yeah, this is bad. Yeah, I'm here at the, uh, about to go to this work event, and the parking lot is 
one of our prime uh, dog walking areas again. Yeah. Okay, come on. Well, it's March 1st, 2024, 7, 10 a.m., 36 degrees Fahrenheit. We're out here with Bo this morning. We're doing a poop walk, and then we got to go into work. Well, it's Friday morning, March 1st. 2024, it's 38 degrees Fahrenheit. And 7.15 a.m. We're out here with Bo this morning. Do a poop walk. Maybe run into Rudy. We're a little late in the game to meet up with him. But I'm pretty sure he's out here this morning. Well, I was thinking just now, it's about 20 degrees cooler this morning than yesterday morning. I was trying to figure out why, but uh, the local Circle K Exxon Mobil gas station, right by Bo's house there, yesterday, they were having a 40 cents off per gallon special for whatever reason, uh, which means a lot more of the carbon tax was collected yesterday here locally and uh, consequently it's a lot cooler here this morning it's interesting but I mean it might be anecdotal but I think that's clear evidence that high taxation cools the climate which is what we need here in Washington State because oftentimes it's just uh, it's too warm for the citizens Uh, we got some people coming up here now. Hey, Rudy, good morning. How's it going this morning? How's it going? What's happening? Where are you going?
Well, we're here at the turnaround point. There really hasn't been a whole lot of action for whatever reason. It's morning. Well, the walk is going pretty good, but we got a, some kind of trekker crossing our path here. Go easy, Bo. Well, that gentleman, it's from the Philippines. Yeah, that would be saying because before he moved to America, they used to eat dog. And uh, he moved to America and married a white woman. And now they have dogs in their bed that they treat as family members. I don't know if I got that part on, on tape there, but very odd gentleman to have a dog in a bed and, and treat him like a family member. Ain't no I think that's a kind of a good thing. Might be another poop burning. Yeah. yeah. 